Good morning, happy Thursday. Um, so I finished stream, and then I was like laying in my bed, just vibing, watching TikToks and stuff. And I was like, oh, I should get up. It's light outside. It's like 5 a.m. I need to be up in like two hours for work. <laughs> I'm a mess. Um, great stream though, had a fantastic time. We hit 3,000 followers on Twitch, which is like crazy cool. And then earlier this week, I hit 500 on my Keeper CGC YouTube channel, which I've been building since the beginning of the year, which is exciting. I also got an email for a key for a game that I played the demo of and loved, and I haven't even like promoted about it yet. It was just all good things. Um, <laughs> I think I was gonna vlog today anyway, so I figured I'd start it with my tragic, like, you can see there's light out there with my tragic existence today. Oh, I need to turn off that light. My hue lights I can turn off with my voice, but this one I have to turn off otherwise. But I'm gonna go to sleep now, and I'll see you probably in a couple hours at the theater, or maybe after my nap, depending. Good night. Good still morning. <laughs> I got like no sleep because obviously I laid in bed and I couldn't get to sleep and probably part of it was because I was like, oh my god, I have no time to sleep. Um, I think I probably, you know what, I maybe got 90 minutes of sleep, which would probably be the most ideal because of that like sweet REM cycle. But anyways, we're here. Worst case scenario, I just have a nap on my break. <laughs> Drool on a chair somewhere. Um, actually, you know what, there, we've got like these, these benches here. <laughs> And I have put two of them together because they're only like two seats wide. I've put two of them together in the past and stellar place to sleep. We also have like the couches in the green room, but they're not very comfortable. Um, so this is the way to go. <laughs> Besides the fact that all the lights are on. But anyways, I am here, which is exciting. It's not. Um, <laughs> I was walking up to the door though. And normally like I get out of the car and I like say the alarm code in my head. I was walking up to the door. I was almost out of the door. I was like, uh-oh. But the alarm didn't go off, so clearly we figured it out. <laughs> so that's good. Um, I have more energy. I feel like when I come to work, my energy goes, okay, we're working now, so you're fine. And like, I can be fine. I can go out and run errands. The second I get home, my body's like, it is nap time. You promised me this. And it's wild, but it kind of works. I'm thinking it should be quick today, fingers crossed. Um, because we're like in like a chill period. This weekend goes chaotic again. I've talked about it. And then it kind of just peters out till the end of the month and then July is like non-existent which is fantastic because I can stream more if I want to or specifically I can degenerate degenerate degen I can be a degenerate that's the one um <laughs> into the later hours um which will be nice <laughs> also like totally unrelated but I've been playing this game called Palia which is a little bit heavier on my computer than other games that I've played and Wesley was like, I think it's time to think about getting some upgrades to your PC. But I'm like, here's the thing. And I'm so sorry if you don't know, care about computer stuff. <laughs> so sorry. When I did my build initially, I was going to go for a budget build. I bought the motherboard. I bought the RAM. And then I was like, you know what? Let's up that a little bit. So we upped it. All good. All fine. The thing is, if I'm going to build another computer, if I'm going to spend the money on upgrades and building another computer... I'm, it does, here, I, I would need a new motherboard and I would need a new CPU, like bare minimum. But if I'm getting a new motherboard, I'm gonna get DDR5 instead of DDR4, which I currently have, which means my RAM would not be compatible. So then I also need to get a new, uh, new RAM. Okay, so now that's like three parts. And then like beyond that, the only other things you need besides like fans are, a graphics card and a power supply and a case so if I'm gonna upgrade I might as well just build new and then theoretically if I can figure out how to do it I can dual PC stream which would then take the load entirely off of one for doing any graphical um, encoding and then the other one could just be games or what one just for games one just for the encoding um, and the streamings and then like imagine the extra storage space I guess I would need to get some storage. But anyways, yeah, so that's kind of like my thoughts is if I'm gonna do it, I might as well just do it. But oh my God, everything's so expensive. We were talking about a stream yesterday and someone's like, oh, I'm thinking about doing a new build and it's gonna be DDR5 based. And so she sent me her things and stuff. Um, well, like the MOBO, RAM and 
CPU. CPU is almost the exact same one that I have, just a little bit up. Like I have the 3600, I think it's the 5800. Or sorry, 37, I have 3700. Um, and then the motherboard looks pretty good because one of the things too is like, I have so many USB things plugged into my computer. So like I need a lot of USB slots. This motherboard has 10 built in. And then theoretically, I could use my PCI card theoretically, if it fits, um, that has another five. So I can give me like 15 plus anything that's on the case, which would be on the front. So that could be 17 right there, which I think is more than I have. I wanna say I have 14 now because of my extra slots, but anyways. Um, so it's something to think about because obviously it is a cost. The Mobos look, the one that she sent me, which look, like I said, looks pretty good is like 350. And then the two sticks at 16 gigs, of RAM is 250, between 170 and 250, I can't remember, I was looking at a couple. Um, and then, I don't even remember the price of the CPU, but I'm gonna guess between four and $500 Canada, am I right? Um, so, anyways, that's where we're at, I'm thinking. But like, Twitch is doing really well right now, so I'm like, I could just reinvest. So, I don't know, we'll see. But yeah, time to work, time to stop rambling, time to get the show on the road because the sooner I get started, the sooner I can leave. <laughs> my room is the hottest it's been in some time, and I understand it sounds like I'm in a wind tunnel, and I am sorry, but it's like 27 degrees in here. I'm literally dying. I just woke up from a nap, which I knew was gonna happen. I need to go to the store and get almost nothing that I needed. <laughs> I need new work pants, and I looked for Cricut iron-on stuff, and they didn't have any of that. But anyways, froggies have arrived. Um, these are my Mike Boom frogs. They come from Frog Tree Games which is a Canadian-based small business. And they're all the frogs that I have. First of all, so we have three coming in today. <laughs> this is Avocado. I love the green on him. Like, maybe my favorite green frog that we've got so far. And he's got a little pit. A little pit on his tummy. Isn't he precious? I love him, okay. Next we have Bread, which already is a favorite <laughs> because I love bread. I literally bought a loaf of French bread today because I was bread. So this is him here. He's like slightly, slightly browned around the edges. <laughs> My precious angel baby. And last but not least, we have egg. Egg's got a little hump. <laughs> I'm obsessed with them. I'm so excited to add them to the rotation. They're so cute. Also, I don't think I've mentioned it, but the person in Frog Tree Games, she's been like posting like Things are coming. I don't know if she's doing a backer kit or a Kickstarter this um, summer, but take my money because I think there's gonna be another six frogs. And I'm like, how am I going to do this? I was like, maybe I just draw them, but I know people love to vote. So what I think I'll do is a mixture because there'll be 18 frogs by that point. That's too many. 12 already feels like a lot. What I'll do is on stream, I'll do a drawing um, for the frogs that are gonna be in the next vote. That's the only thing I think to do. But yeah, they're so precious. Okay, time to talk to my man. <laughs> and probably hydrate, it's it's a warm one. <laughs> and then tonight I'm gonna do some recording because I need to, but minimal, minimal. Oh my goodness, it, today has not gone as planned. Things came up in the Discord that I discovered about a community member that is not okay. And so it's kind of been a bit of a, um, just gong show um getting through stuff we've we had to remove somebody from the community we are reaching out to another person um i've had to update safety policy for the discord and stream and like telling people like you know if you feel uncomfortable with anything reach out to the mods you know if somebody's made you uncomfortable elsewhere reach out to the mods so we're aware of this in case it escalates so that's been going on since like Oh my goodness, I don't even know. Let me see if I can, let me see if I can find when this started. 623 was when this started. It is 1017 and we are still dealing with things right now. <laughs> Two, three, four. All right, all five of my mods that are conscious. Oh wait, wrong thing. I was like, all five of my mods that are conscious agreed with this. Um, I'm like, can somebody take the lead on this other thing? Cause I'm dealing with this much larger thing. So yeah, that's where we're at, except I, um, <laughs> I 
was unable to message the person because I removed them from the server and they're set up so you can't message them unless they're unless you're in the same server so well if they ask they'll know <laughs> and I have the message copied for later but yeah so that's been fun I hope to start recording at like I don't know nine usually when Wesley starts going live but he actually just started at like 9 45 um, because he was out a bit late and we were chatting anyways I don't love doing this stuff I just want to create a safe community where everybody just follows the rules and I don't have to kick people out and I don't have to talk to people about things but yeah that's where we're at so I just my mod crafted something another mod suggests something to add to it to something that they're dealing with and I just like took their two things and smushed them together and you know and so that's being taken care of which is nice um it's, i can't remember if i mentioned but i've added a new mod not officially yet so just like hanging on the discord channels and stuff and i'm like welcome to the party <laughs> and then we're working on like trying to get another uh staff mod meeting going on soon but yeah uh, that's where we're at oh i also bought some stuff i went to winners and i bought some stuff so I'll share that with you because that's exciting. Give me a second. Terrible lighting, I know. Also, I'm like so sick of living in a wind tunnel. It's not even funny. Anyways, um, I got <laughs> a few things. Okay, okay, okay. I should have been more prepared. I said I was gonna be prepared, but I didn't. Anyways, I got this, which is just like a little like plastic drawer, but because I just got a bunch more postcards and stuff, I kind of like, they're just a mess everywhere, so I want to have a place where I could put them, I can put my stamps in here and stuff too, and this will just be a dedicated postcard spot, I can move it, I can take it with me when I eventually move, I can keep this separate, so if I have to send any, we can do that, so that's exciting. I've also been looking for a sleep mask for a while, so I decided to try this one here, it's Relax Zen, <laughs> Relaxin, <laughs> Um, we'll see. Just cause like, sometimes I'm, I feel like a bug. Sometimes I'm trying to sleep during the day or when the sun has come up, like this morning. Oh my goodness. How did the lighting get that much worse? Was it this? It was probably this. Um, so I decided to get that. And then I got these two sets of eye patches. I love a good eye patch. And I think... I want to say there's like, these are made in Korea, the, the deep focus, oh that may be just the brand, in gold and purple. I love these. I love putting them in the fridge so they're nice and uh, cool. Um, and I'm getting a bit low and it was six bucks for like I say, I think there's probably six packs in here. Oh, eight packs. That's exciting. So yeah, anyways, I'll put those in the fridge with my other ones. And, um, yeah, that's exciting. I got some cool things. I'm excited about this. I had... I had a face mask that I loved, but then I ended up washing it. And it just no longer fit properly. And so I've been wanting to get a new one for a while. Um, but I, I'm picky. I'm picky. So I'm hoping that goes well. But, yeah, we'll put the postcards in here. And that'll be good. Oh, my God, I love the frog so much. I actually bought a loaf of French bread today. I would love, I would have named him Loaf probably instead of Bread, but that's okay. I need to figure out emotes for these guys too, because they will be votes. All right, I've got a little bit of a pile of clothes here again um, from recording, <laughs> and also that I just never put away. Anyways, it is, oh, it's 5 a.m., which is perfect, because I can test this out tonight, today. I mean, I nap a lot, so I can usually sleep without having issues, but I just wanted to have it. Um, I got, I was like, after the whole stuff that went down the Discord, I was having like a hard time <laughs> rallying and being energetic, so I struggled a little bit, but I managed to, I switched focus on what I was planning on recording and I recorded something else and I enjoyed it, so that was nice. Um, and it kind of like calmed me and soothed me. I don't feel like I got as much in as I would have liked to get done, but I got some stuff done. It's just turning me pink. Um, and now I'm gonna go sleep, and I'm gonna wake up at like probably one or two, because it is five. <laughs> so, yeah, it, we're just a mess sleep-wise, but it's fine. Pretty soon, work will be less, so it doesn't matter if my sleep schedule is trash, right? Anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you have an amazing, fantastic, wonderful existence, and I will see you in the next one. <laughs> Bye!